Good morning, everybody. Guys, getting ready to edit here on Sunday. I just happened to be flipping through my phone real quick, and uh, I just apparently I don't know what it is. One of the weather things comes up, and it's still in California. It is 10 degrees warmer in California than it is in Pennsylvania. It is 27 degrees here. I didn't know California got down to 37 degrees. <laughs> I guess in the right circumstances, but good morning. I just thought that was kind of funny. Oh, time to import and uh, get this bad boy uh, edited. And uh, yeah, it sounds like they're. Um... Oh, I don't know what that is. Salky Tech. He's he's constantly switching phones worse than me. But uh, I don't even know if I mentioned it. But yeah, the uh, it looks like this 2020 was the last year of the Note series. They're switching it out. They're going to add pen support to the S21. And the pen will actually go with the Fold 3 next year. So, <laughs> it's like I'm holding on to something that's going to be uh, the last of its breed. Oh, all right. I got this bad boy edited and then time to get puppies and myself moving. We are 20, 28 miles away from uh, this challenge being done. Shane texted me last night. He goes, I don't even try and I got my challenge. Shut up, jerk. <laughs> It's all in, it's all in fun. I don't mean it, but, uh, whew, which means if I would not have lost those two days, I would only have to go two miles today and be done. Whew, it's a brisk one this morning out here. Some places there's still frost in the grass. Get little girl out for her lunch. She's done all her business. Such a good girl. She's getting it slowly. <laughs> oh, man. It's gonna be a rough one. Not feeling the best today, that's for sure. But I haven't taken my secret cold medicine yet today either. Oh wait, after I walked the tail for that, I did pull out one of my hats because I think it was 27 this morning. Like I said, uh, California was 37. That's just crazy. So, oh, cold front across. Get these guys off to the park here. Might do Heshbon. Might do Southside. And then we'll just call it a day. Come home and walk a few more of these. I'm not really much in an adventure mode today. <laughs> it's gonna be blowing my nose most of the day, it feels like. Alrighty, guys. I haven't done a park run in a while. So, shit, did I grab my hat? Do I need my hat? Take two. Alright, I think we're ready to go now. Okay, yeah, that cold air, not so much gonna be a thing. And see on, and we are on our way. I really had plans on doing multiple parks today, but Terry's not feeling well, so she's off. So I'm not gonna be gone for all day long. 11-11, make a wish, guys. Oh, I just hope I can get through this because I'm a little on the, the weaker side today i'm not i'm not feeling like i have a whole ton of energy but after you know taking the dogs for their walks this morning the longer i went the better it was uh, last night's last walk um i didn't even say good night got home and went to bed but i just happened i knew my watch was on its you know it was on in red for a while and i didn't really think about it i took priya for a lap Never started the timer or anything, but still it's tracking and didn't grab my phone. <clears throat> Tail and I are walking. I look at my watch about less than halfway around and it was at 2%. And then it dropped to 1. We busted our ass to get back. So I want to make sure it tracked the whole walk. <laughs> we made it. But it was like, oh no. <laughs> and they did pave the other side of that to make like a little loop around now. Curious to see what they do for the jet, like I said a couple days ago. Beautiful booking day out. The sun is shining. Um, air is just chilly. It's 43, so it's moved up from 27 to 43 now. Um, just gonna, I, I have an idea what we might do, but of course plans always seem to change once we get there. Because um, I only have like probably a mile and a half under me right now. And it was... 12 hundredths of a mile short last night, so I need the full 13.84 today. Yeah, that 
that's going to be uh, <laughs> a challenge in itself. Well, it looks like we have the park mostly to ourselves today. And it is an absolutely gorgeous Sunday. Hello, Mr. Sun. <laughs> All right, here we go. Don't know exactly. I have a, a game plan. I just don't know if it's going to actually come out. Oh, nothing else. We're gonna, we're gonna do as much as we can, <sighs> and I'm not gonna really pressure them too much. I'm just gonna take a leisure walk and see how far we can get with it. <laughs> yeah, for these two, no big deal. Two miles in. God knows how much more to go. <sighs> kind of wanna. I know what I want to do. I don't want to say it because then if I don't do it, I feel like I failed. <laughs> <sighs> At least I do know what we're going to try to do here. Initially, we are going to go to the bridge, we're going to cross it, we're going to go all the way down to the parking lot I was at that day. I did the camera comparison with the, <clears throat> the Note 20 and the uh, Sony RX107. Um, I'm going to go down that far and then when we turn around and come back, we'll see if not we can make the full lap. That's the full game plan, but Let's see where we at when we get back to the bridge. <laughs> On the bridge. I haven't made it this far. Just under three miles right now. Of course, we didn't take the outer edge of the park, so it kind of cut us down a bit. We're about four tenths of a mile, that adds. We're getting her done. Come on, guys, you gotta get over. Hey, right, everybody's still going here. We're approaching the five and a half mile mark. We went places we've never been before. Well, I've never even been before. <laughs> bike packed path wraps back around and heads towards Montoursville and we had to go a few tenths of a mile just to get to five so I wanted to have a five out and I don't know what we're going to have back because fortunately nature is really trying to call me right now and I just uh, have nowhere to go. I had a spot picked out where somebody would stand there. Just curious to see if she gets lippy with the mountain man again or the logger. <laughs> Taylor wanted to cross the bridge, he's ready to go home. But we're gonna cross the bridge eventually. Can you give him any business? No, nope. didn't care today. Sorry, bud. See you in the morning today. <laughs> okay. Once again, Priya's back out front. She's led most of this. The return trip, Mateo started to lead, but now he's falling back again with me. I don't blame him. And we're coming up on the dam. Yeah, well, Shane can't cross now, bud. It was almost to the point where you could have walked across that and I missed my opportunity. I want to get over to the island one time and take a video, but I don't know if you can be worth it. Yeah, get over. I'm not going to lie, this has been a tough one. Uh, to vlog it, at least. The walk itself hasn't been overly bad. It's just I'm using quite a bit of energy to keep myself going. We are moving up on mile 8. <laughs> and then we gotta cross the river and make our way back. Don't think we're making another lap around the park because we're gonna be way up there in miles. But uh, we're getting her done. Nice day for it though. Right. And our way across by ourselves for the first time ever. Now we're in front of us and we're hauling ass. <laughs> we just leave the group. Put us at 11.25. And we are back to the dam. That is if things track right that one morning. We are two miles away from the car. Come on, Priya. Oh, we're almost from where we actually crossed over. Right there is the bridge. It's all started already. Well, we are pretty darn close to exceeding our longest walk ever. We just hit the 10 mile mark. And I want to say 10.28 was when I was late for work that day. But that was a lot different walk, that's for sure. <laughs> Definitely didn't do it in the same time either. Um, two hours and 59 minutes. Not that far off, I guess, because that was like 2.48. Uh, 11 minutes ain't really a lot considering I got two dogs. What are we averaging? 17.48 a mile is our average. So, a little higher, but hey. We're getting done. We're not back yet. We're going to be pretty damn close to 11th mile. So, we 
exactly what I was figuring. <laughs> oh my god, we are back to the park. We are, we're gonna just nail 11 miles, I think. It's gonna be right there when we hit the car. Just unbelievable. That is just an incredible distance. In three hours and 13 minutes, we have been walking, so I got another couple minutes to go here, and then we're going to McDonald's. We survived. I think it was like 11.03, something like that. <sighs> Obviously, we <laughs> we didn't do the park twice. Uh, there's no way. I am my both both ankles and shins are killing me. My hips, surprisingly, um, are just probably have my pants buttoned too tight, or pulled too tight, or something today, but. That is a long trip. So what we did was we went around the park, stayed on the pavement today, then around the other portion of the park, out to the bridge, crossed the bridge, and then went all the way back to that parking lot I was uh, at. And we were not quite at five miles. We were at like uh, 4.7 something. So we kept going down until we hit the five mile mark, and I'm damn glad we did, because otherwise we would have had like 10.5. <laughs> or 10.7 and that would have pissed me off whoo that was a walk all right off to mickey d's on the strip on the golden strip no 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 on the coming crook road she wants a fish fillet not that any of us are going to taste anything i'm getting but we're getting mcdonald's i don't know if we're still making soup later or not well, needless to say, on a single walk, that broke some records. Um, I don't I have to look at the details, but my watch like pinged like six different things went off. <laughs> it's like, damn, I have 217 active minutes now for the day. I'm not going to break that record today, that is for sure, because that is, what, 310 now? I, I can't say that I'll never break it, but I definitely don't want to be... Uh, sick when I try to do it, because uh, I think that's why I'm hurting so bad. I'm definitely taking pain pills when I get on them. That was, uh, it was an adventure. And these guys, they, Mateo, he literally got carried for maybe about 20 feet at one point, and I was like, dude, you're too heavy. I can't do it. <laughs> Freaking your nose. Her nose knows, don't you? You know a guy who's got something good for you. It's not good for you, but it's good tasting and it's for you. Yeah. Does that make sense? <coughs> anyway, health-wise, it's bad for them. But anyway, they got double quarter pound, or they got double cheeseburgers, each one, and some fries for them, as well as us. I'm not sure she made my sandwich right, because the way my thing is reading out, it's not what I asked for. They now have uh, a quarter pounder with cheese and bacon, so I asked if that could be made into a double. She said she could do that, but she couldn't run it as a a meal. I don't know, because it says quarter pounder. It doesn't say double. Uh, whatever. I'm not that, not that frugal with tasting right now, so probably it would be a waste anyway. <laughs> She's just... <laughs> yeah, is that a bag of food? You know, don't you? You know. <laughs> is it good? Was it... Was it? Was it good? Slow down, Mateo. Calm down, buddy. Slow down. Calm down. It's okay, buddy. It's even breathe. <laughs> this is good. It's not even breathing. Yeah, trying to get everybody back off couches is fun tonight. <laughs> He's walking pretty good, actually. Come on, we're going around here. Yeah, I've been e extending this thing, going around the, the curb here. Just makes a little extra, especially at night. I can't do the. Big loop back there. Going late. Come on, baby. We're almost done. Yay. Mateo on his lap should have done it to actually have the right mileage for today. And then her lap puts a half mile over. And each one's going to get one more lap before the day's out. So, hoorah. Put me up a mile and a half for tomorrow. That'll be beneficial. I don't think we're going on another 11 mile journey, though. That was a little insane. Yeah, we're probably going to get back into watching probably about five more episodes of uh, Vampire Diaries. And we're in the middle of season four, I think, about. <laughs> so I'm going to call it a night. Thanks so much for watching. I will see you in the morning, as always, and have a good night.
There may be some full moon pictures if I get off my ass and take pictures of it because it is uh, quite majestic tonight. Thanks for watching. Good night. Uh, the flash is probably going to ruin that, but there's a huge ring around. Uh, let's see if the ultraviolet lens can pick it up. I don't think it can. Damn. <laughs> All right, no flash. That is pretty cool. I think you can kind of see the ring around the edges there. Yeah. That is neat. All right, yeah. We're on our last walk of the night. I know I said goodnight already, but I thought that was kind of cool.